the court case in which Zimbabwe's mainstream opposition party, the Citizens Coalition for Change, Triple C, led by advocate Nelson Chamisa, is interdicting a man who claims to be the party's secretary general, Sengezo Chabangu, which set on Monday has been postponed to Tuesday, 2.30. The party is seeking a court interdict which will stop Chabangu, whose marauding behavior has seen him recall more than 20 members of the opposition party and more than 60 councillors all over Zimbabwe claiming that they had ceased to be members of the opposition party. The case was postponed after Chabangu's legal team failed to file their opposing affidavits within the court's timelines. Instead of filing on Thursday, they submitted their documents on Friday, which was after the court's deadline. We hear a legal representative of Triple C speaking to the media. Last week we appeared before uh, Justice Chitapi and the matter was postponed today at half past two for argument. In the meantime, the judge had given directives the timelines within which to file our respective papers. The first respondent, Mr. Chabangu, was directed to file his opposing papers by end of business on Thursday, and we were going to file our answering affidavit by end of business on Friday. That hasn't happened because uh, Mr. Chabangu then filed his papers on Friday. As a result, we we're only able to file our own papers uh, this morning. So the judge needs time to go through the papers and we are coming back to court tomorrow at um, half past two for argument. And in the meantime, the interim order which was granted by the court last week remains in force. Ms. Chawangu is not allowed to effect any further recalls until this matter has been finalized. We have heard that there is an application to expand members of people to that uh, uh, contesting in the line of the violence is too complicated. Those that we record in the end, any truth from that? What is that? What is the situation? I'm hearing it from you uh, for the first time. I haven't seen the papers. Uh, now that you've mentioned it, I'm going to look for those papers and see at the basis of the application. Only then will I be in a position to formulate an opinion, of course, after consulting my client. On the way forward, we have said that uh, the, the, the interim court, the, the court order from last week, will see uh, that uh, there will be no more report. But it seems that even after the court order, there, there was a report of 18 inches. Does so that mean that uh, the court order is not sticking? What, what does that mean? The court order remains valid. Whatever happened after the court order is a subject of uh, another proceedings which are coming. It seems as if we are going to embrace ourselves for a season of litigation after litigation. It's going to be exciting for you as the members of the 46. Thank you. Advocate, so what, what, from a legal point of view, is the, if, if the expunge uh, application succeeds, what, what does it mean? What are the implications? Well, well like I said, I haven't seen the papers and uh, uh, I'm not too sure whether or not uh, that is the cause of action that they've brought before uh, before the Honorable Court. So I don't want to uh, be tempted into commenting on something that I haven't had sight of. But as soon as I see it, I can assure you, you'll be the first one to know.